And now let's welcome Korea Credit Live. Korea Credit Live is a fintech company which provides consumers with new payment exchange. Are you ready? Please come up on stage. Thank you. Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Steve Lee, and I'm from uh, Korea. And my company is Korea Credit Life, and we're a fintech and auto platform company. We have a 470,000 merchants that's with partnership with First Data in Korea, and we have an open API. We also have a, a delivery services that's linked with partnerships. We have online and offline mobile payment and payment gateways. We're location-based loyalty program API providers, and this whole solution is called EMO, which stands for Everything Mobile Ordering. And our service is a platform. We have a hardware and software platforms that's implementing together. Did you know that you can increase your sales with Emo? Emo is the smart platform that processes orders and payments from all different applications from over 10 million users. It's done using a POS system without the need for any complicated management system. In addition, Emo provides takeout service ordering and payments in advance. And you can increase sales by taking delivery orders without hiring your own delivery person. You can also increase sales by improving stamps and mileage systems. Everything is possible with Emo. No flyers or coupons are needed anymore. Emo will provide analysis of customer information and sales data. Emo can help you get a loan with a low interest rate based on sales data if necessary. Contact one of our Emo representatives now. Okay, this is the problem that we have with mobile payment industry. You have Apple Pay, you have Android Pay, you have Kakao Pay, you have Samsung Pay, and you have a, a Food Panda, you have a a lot of these different types of old tool services and, and payment apps, but it's all fragmented. They need to have their own merchants to utilize their own services only. Okay? And each of those services have to actually acquire merchants for them, their service to be used. And customers has to actually only use and serve merchants for Apple Pay or Android Pay or PayPal. It's, they have limited merchants to actually use their services and they don't have a hardware or software and there's no platform laid out or infrastructure laid out as of now. Simply there's no places to use. We have a solution with this email platform. We have a hardware and software solutions where actually you could utilize all these payment apps or all tool service apps come into our platform and you could utilize all the merchants that's been uh, using in our platform and simply mean that all these customers could actually just go in and simply use their favorite restaurants or their favorite gym or favorite beauty, beauty shops. This is the potential market that we see. The mobile payment transaction market in Asia is expected to have a revenue of one trillion US dollar by 2020. And auto market in Korea is estimated at $260 billion. And Indonesia market is estimated $130 billion by 2020. The addressable market in Korea for Imos is estimated to be $30 billion. And we're looking at a to start off with $50 million US dollar. It's readily accessible market with partnership with First Data. We have 470,000 merchants that actually deploy. We started to deploy these hardware and software. These are the potential partners. So we're a platform, again. We don't directly do services in our own. We do partnership with these merchants 
or payment services providers or service or tool service pro provider apps, which meaning that they will come into our platform to utilize their services, their payments, their loyalty programs. These are the traction that we have. We have a partnership with a first data, and we have a their backend server that is access to their backend server is synced to our backend server. And we have a partnership with Delivery Heroes in Korea. And we're ongoing negotiation with all tool services, e-commerce e companies, and finance companies. These are the revenue stream, the existing plus email service fees and API partner fees in financing solutions. And these are the hardware and software. And these are the international expansion plans that we have. We have a joint venture with a Indonesia largest game company to utilize their game money to have it e wallet services. So simply using their game money to be used offline and online. And we have a strong combining team with 40 plus years of IT and 30 plus of finance uh, industries. And this is what we're looking for right now, about two million US dollars. And we're gonna be using it for mostly sales marketing and overseas expansions and uh, software R&Ds. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, our friends. Thank you, Ria.